is. I already know what it is. You guys probably don't. So, yeah. Um, and this thing is not wanting to open, Mr. Scissors. You gotta work harder. Alright then. Alright, so now we got that side. Pretty good. Uh, cardboard flying everywhere. Jeez, my fingers don't even fit in, Mr. Scissors. I should have gotten the big ones. I just wanted to rush to make this video. <laughs> I just literally went in the other room, got the tripod, and, uh, yeah. Start recording. So, uh, luckily today the mailman came extremely earlier than usual. Came around, like... What was it like 12:45? Not even 12:45. 12:30-ish, which is extremely early for him. So um, yeah. Let's let's see. And now, sorry if you couldn't see me. Start to uh, unbox. It. Oh my jeez. Uh, let's uh, I don't know if this is in the best shape ever. To be honest, that little box, but nothing literally inside of it anymore. But we got plastic wrap, and as you can see right here, the limited edition Pokemon first series 23 karat gold plated trading card, and it's Charizard. Um, on the back of it, you can see that we got. All different types. We got Charizard, Pikachu, Jigglypuff, Poliwhirl, Mewtwo, and also Togepi. So, uh, I probably should face this down more so it's much closer to me. So now, uh, let's just, uh, try to open up. Oh my. I, I feel so bad because this is from 1999. This plastic wrap has been on it. So, um, it's in a pretty good state to be from 1999, this packaging. It's not that all destroyed. The corners look pretty alright. They do have like a little bit of, of uh, some bangs right in there. Uh, there you go. Yeah, they do have like a little bit of that stuff right there. But, and especially on this one right there. So, uh, but otherwise it's in a really good condition, this thing. I would think that would be a little bit more banged up, but luckily it's not. Um... So, uh, yeah, we don't need our code. Um, now let's open this bad boy up. I don't want to really ruin the packaging that all that much. Okay. So, that's the best I can probably get it to be open. And now, we got the Pokeball. I'm definitely going to keep that box. And, uh, let's open up this Pokemon. Uh, uh, I have to rip open. Oh, jeez. Tripod fell. Don't worry. We're all good. All good. All good here. Now, um, jeez, this thing. So, um, here we go. We got, jeez, I think it's falling over again. Uh, yeah, let's fix that. Alright. I think it's fixed. I think I gotta tighten it a bit more, but it's good for now. Now, this is the limited edition Pokeball. A little bit. It has a little bit of smudges, I gotta say, on it. Not that much. But, as you can see, it's chrome. Hello! Um, so, let's open this up. Oh. My. Alright, so, um, oh jeez, it's coming apart. <laughs> it can easily come off. Um, Alright guys, sorry about that. Um, recording stopped due to low storage, so I better get this done quick. But, anyways, this is the Charizard, as you can see, right there. Um, let me try to, there we go. It says Charizard and copyright 1999. Nintendo on there, and, uh, it says on the back, the, um, length is 5 foot 7, it's so tiny, and the weight is 200 pounds, and it says the flame Pokemon spits fire that 
that is n not that is hot enough to melt boulders known to cause forest fires unintentionally and the evolution on this uh it's right there it's kind of hard to see all right so and it goes from charmander to charmeleon and uh that's a level 16 charmeleon to what it says is a level 36 or is that 35 35 with 36 Charizard. I cannot see that. But it says Made in China right there. So, um... And also, we got the Certificate of Authenticity. Right there. And it says, uh... Official Seal of Quality, Nintendo. And, uh, number 6 Charizard. And, uh, that is the, uh... The Chairman of Nintendo of America at the time. Not sure if he's still, uh... The same guy that's currently doing it today. Oh, jeez. That's currently doing it right now. But that's cool. So, and, um, link in the description down below if you want to get this. Um, is about 35 bucks on Amazon. Um, and it is so worth it. I had to get a piece of cardboard to stand this up. But it stands up on any flat surface just fine. So, um, if you like this video, please like and subscribe to join the crafters for more unboxing videos. Maybe doing one, another one next week. Um, but that is very cool. So uh, please like and subscribe to join the crafters for more. And I'll see you all later. Goodbye.